All right, Dave, thanks for volunteering again. All right, so now that we've talked about the brow point or the brow chakra, the third eye, and the key center, what we want to do is uh, talk about how that point is manipulated. We've been talking about moving forward and backward, and then now we're going to talk a little bit about side to side. But I want to use a move from a couple of forms to illustrate this point. Okay, so from a taekwondo form, he comes around here, he grabs me in a bear hug with my arms free from the front. We have a move where we post the hand in the small of the back. And then we grab under here these two points on the net. And we're going to step forward and we're going to push this point over until this third eye point passes the key to take him to the floor. Okay, and that's from uh, Tegluk Saga, I believe. And then also to manipulate that same third eye key center, we're going to use a movement from a Tai Chi form where if he throws a punch with his hand, I'm coming this direction. And then I'm going to switch back to here. And this time, I'm manipulating the third eye point over the ear hole, or the ear hole over the third eye point from going left to right. So off of the punch here, we're coming in and then here, and we're manipulating this point left to right to bring him over. So we're going to deflect the punch, move back, grab the back of the head, lift the arm and turn. And that's the application of that movement using the manipulation of the third eye point. All right, so just practice those two moves real quick from the form, especially the second one moving left to right, since we've been working forward to back, and then we'll move on to the second uh, balance point.
LegacyBelts.com is making legends one belt at a time. This is the company that makes world championship title belts for boxing, wrestling, martial arts, and other special events. Feature films such as I Spy, starring Eddie Murphy and Owen Wilson, and Ali, starring Will Smith, have featured title belts made by Legacy Belts. For more information, check out LegacyBelts.com. LegacyBelts.com, making legends one belt at a time. Okay, the next technique we're going to do is instead of trying to push this lead arm through, we're going to imagine it slipped off. It, it didn't work. Okay, so I'm dead. Don't push it. Oh, man. I missed it. Where'd my hand go when I missed it? There, right? Down, down. To the other elbow. So if you resist and strong enough, and he doesn't let me move this, don't let me move it. Okay, I can't get it. I'm just going to go to the other side. You don't want to give me what I want, I'll take something different. But I'm not going to fight force with force. I'm not going to sit there for two hours and push back and forth with you. I know that if your mindset, if your mindset is dead set on not allowing me to push this arm inward, your, your body is actually trying to move to what direction, everybody? To my left, correct? Which way am I pulling this other elbow? To, to my left. The way he wanted to go. Now it's up to me at this point whether or not I put pressure on his shoulder or I just drag him in or whatever you want to do. Um, the secret is once, once you're pushing here and I do this, what I want is to everybody watch his body to stay like that. Don't move. Okay, can everybody see him? This is the center, right? This is chakra we were talking about earlier. Okay, it's called the yellow chakra, right? This is the chakra we're working on. It's wherever the solar plexus is. I'm trying to move that either this way or this way. And in simple terms in the martial arts, I'll show you what that means. Stand straight up. Shoulder, shoulder, hip, hip. If I cross them, what does it make it perfect? An X. If I turn this into an upside down triangle, he has no balance. So all I need to do is make this X into a Y. Because now it's here. I have the two points down here that's upside down coming up to this one shoulder, correct? As long as he's in an X, it's going to be hard to move him. His symmetry is correct. So I'm going to move him into a Y. And that's all we're trying to do. So when he's pushing on me here, and I'm trying to get this arm and I can't get it, I'm going to pull this elbow, which is going to move this shoulder in the kinetic chain across and make it a Y. Does that make sense? Depending on what you want to do, you've got a guy. We're going to be really careful with this next nerve point. Okay? The mandibular angle. Alright? Right here behind the ear, up in this joint right here. And I'll just go see if we make that cap. Okay. Straight up in. Let the ground be the counter pressure for the technique. Now, I'm not going to give up this arm though. So either I'm going to have to come across this way and do it with a finger, or I'm going to have to reattach this arm here and then come down into it. Don't give this arm up while you're trying to do it. This is going to roll and spin underneath you. This keeps you from spinning. So I've got this shoulder completely contorted to where it cannot go back any farther. Your body's running meant to go in so many degrees in that angle. That makes sense to everybody? Okay. You. Okay. Take one day training. Fellowship and Spirit. The U.S. National Taekwondo Association is your link to the traditional Taekwondo of Korea. We offer both national and world certifications. 
Our mission is to provide a fraternal organization for the promotion and preservation of Taekwondo as a martial art. We strive to service all needs of the traditional stylist from the highest level grandmaster to the beginner student. Enjoy the many benefits we offer. Grade and black belt certifications, instructor and master instructor courses, tournament insurance, success seminars, state, national, and international competitions, business support, martial arts supplies, monthly e-newsletter, and private training tours of Korea. Not only do we teach the best techniques, but Korean philosophy as well. We develop the complete mind, body, and spirit philosophy. Visit www.usmta.net to join today.
as you can see right here, it's not really that safe, but this will give you an opportunity, uh, you know, to see that you can work out at any point, any time, even if it's uh, during rush hour in Baltimore, which is one of the worst places for traffic in the world. So, uh, and then you can easily get a little bit of a heart pumping too. Uh, so no matter where you are, you can definitely uh, get a workout. Now I am a little concerned about what's going on down here. Looks like the Popo, and unfortunately that's not even my car. My car is about another mile down the road. So instead of calling AAA, taking a nap in my car, I decided to get out, start running, and uh, go knock this problem out. So, hey, whatever your problem is, whatever your goal is, just knock them out. Hey, soulblock.com, people. Our God's an awesome God. Chill. Right down here. pretty good. I just told him that I, uh, I'm so blocked for Soul Block TV. Right. My trainer, George Ferocity MMA, you know, he kind of hits me in the head with, hey, you want to burn fat? Look, you know, it's not going out there and sprinting. It's that fast-paced walking. You know, it's that, that uh, nice, smooth, steady pace on the bike. You really don't start really eating into that dead fat till 35 minutes. So, you know, don't stop at 35 either. If you can go like 50 minutes, 60 minutes, that's when you really get into that fat burning. So, uh, holy shoot. Tony, man, it's not safe out here. Show, man. Uh, wow. I'm starting to think I might have got freaking tired. I already made it home. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, Timmy. Hey, Mike. Ladasha, what's up? Dre Johnson's up in there. Yeah, I know all these people. They know me too, but uh, I got it. It stinks. But we're pumping gas, people. We're pumping gas. I just want to thank all my co-workers, all my clients uh, that have just... Uh, here this morning and just let me do what I'm doing because we all do what we do and uh, you know you know what actually now I think about probably not too many people actually take 695 west to uh, security boulevard maybe that's what it was maybe not one person from the office that radio one or any of my like 75 clients no one all right let's see if this thing works come on come on come on come on no whammies no whammies no whammies yeah! That's what I call it, knocking them out! Yeah! Mm -hmm. uh, I really I really appreciate your message, dude, especially the part where you were like, Hey, I flew by ya! I flew oh, by yeah, ya! I flew yeah, by yeah, ya! I, but, I was sitting there jamming and I was like, I just I was like, hey, going to work, going to work. And I'm like, wait a minute, what's up, my fellas? And I didn't have your number on my cell phone, so I got the work. I'm like, let me call him. Let him know that I could be, uh, Two minutes early or two minutes late. Mr. Howard Mazur, Marcellus Soul Black Cup. Walt, hey, want to let you know there's a very good possibility I'm going to be a few minutes late this morning. Did some research uh, and uh, ended up running out of uh, gas on the side of 695 West. And uh, I thought it would be a good, for, uh, good drop for my new video blog that I started daily to let people know that they should look at the positive side of everything. So the good thing is I got my exercise by running down 695 West and doing curls with a gas can. So I will be to work. Uh, I'm just going to be a little late this morning. All right. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for watching Knock Em Out right here on SoulBlock.com. Yeah, whatever your problem is, whatever your goal is, send it to me at SoulBlock at gmail.com. And let's start knocking them out. Monday through Friday right here on SoulBlock.com. Yeah, and don't miss tomorrow's show because we got the fitness queen on helping you reach your fitness goal between now and Labor Day. Let's go. Write your goals down. Knock them out. <laughs>